Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Integrity Cells and Services. Folks, this afternoon, John and I are excited to give you a nice video of a 2000 4900 International with a big DT 530 300 horsepower motor and an 8LL transmission right behind it to give you all the versatility of gear ratios you could ever dream of. Folks, with that, John's going to fire up this motor and we're going to pop the hood open, let you hear here and see it run. Folks, listen carefully. The intent of this video, folks, is not to give you any kind of pressure at all. It's just simply to display our product in a very honest way that you can get a look up close to see it where there's no other way to take from pictures. Folks, we're going to give you vivid, bright detail here, including coming up and John's going to pull the dipstick. We're going to let you look at the motor oil. We're going to let you look at the blow-by and all. Folks, take a look at that motor oil. It's so clean, you can barely see the yellow color looking at the stick. Folks, take a look at the blow-by. As you can see here, I can hold my hand over there, and there's absolutely no crankcase pressure coming on my hand at all. Take a look at that, folks. Very, very, very low blow-by for a DT motor. Folks, it puts no oil onto my hand. There is no splatter coming out of that tube. Folks, with that, we're going to go ahead and come right here and start on the driver's side steer tire. Folks, look at these beautiful, freshly blasted and painted white wheels with chrome accessories, Bridgestone tires at 60 plus percent tread, nice even wear. Come on down and look at this, folks. You can see the evidence of recent grease job. Nice brakes. I can put my pinky in the peak hole. We have about 80 percent brake shoes. And folks, check this out. A 13,000 pound front axle beam from the factory with a double frame starting right here, going all the way to the back. Folks, where are you going to find a duplicate truck? It's not out there, folks. Check it out. For the money we're asking, you're not going to be able to repeat this process, ladies and gentlemen. Here is a nice truck, beautiful motor block. Look at that radiator for yourself. Absolutely no deterioration on the fins. AC, it's got it all. Folks, with that, let's go on around and give you a look at the passenger side. Okay, folks, let's take a moment here and regroup. You can see we have a total repeat of tire and wheel setup. Nice tread on this side as well. Here you get a better look at that double frame right there. Folks, there is no rust on this sucker and no oil dripping down. Take a look for yourself. I'm telling you, you're going to be hard pressed to ever find a duplicate truck like this. Freshly serviced, new air filter, oil and fuel. Folks, with that, John's going to lower the hood and we're going to continue around the outside. Now, folks, let's take a moment and square up on the front of this truck. And as you can see, we have a perfect I mean, the headlights and everything are just absolutely excellent condition. The bumper's nice, big, heavy tow hooks on the front. Just look how straight and tall that stands. Folks, come on around. Let's take a look at the paint as we go. Again, we're going to get up close here. Take a look around the headlights. No stone chipping at all. Just beautiful, shiny factory paint. Folks, this is original paint on this cab. It's a one owner truck to boot. I'm telling you, you can't beat what we have to offer here. Folks, it was bought brand new with these specs right by the Lowe's company delivering lumber. Folks, that's all this truck ever done. It had a flatbed on it. And folks, it was this wheelbase heavy spec from day one. Look at these fuel tanks, folks. No rust blisters now or ever. It's clean as a brand new tank. Take a look under the cab, folks. With that, let's back off and talk about something even more exciting. Look at this, folks. A brand new 22-foot aluminum grain body by Integrity Manufacturing. Yes, you heard right. We custom build these bodies right here at our location. Folks, we farm and we have for several generations, and we have been manufacturing hopper bottom grain trailers and grain bodies for two generations. Folks, buy from the folks that know and use the product. I'm telling you come up close here John's gonna point out all our solid welding features take a look at that top to bottom no skip welding on our overlaps it's built with our time-tested stamped rib design it's a single wall feature so there's no way for junk and crap to build up between the two layers 
Folks, we have put a lot of engineering and a lot of ingenuity into building these boxes so that you can pass this on down to the next generation. Folks, just take a look. Beautiful slick aluminum body, extremely lightweight. Folks, this whole entire truck weighs less than 20,000 pounds. Where are you going to beat that? Sherlock roll tarp system, it's got it all. We're going to come on back and John's going to take a moment and roll that tarp open for you and we'll just let you see how easy that is to operate. Folks, while he's getting that unhitched, let's take a look at the back of the truck. Folks, as you can see, we have trifold doors on the back, grain chute in the center door. Folks, it's all here with a vented aluminum tarp cap system so you can unload in the rain without opening the tarp. Folks, I'm telling you, it's a thought through package that'll get the job done now and in the future for you. Now look how nice and easy John can open that tarp just effortlessly. That's far enough, John. Let's open that center door now and we'll let him have a look inside. Then you can re-tarp it here in a minute. Folks, as we walk up here, look how effortlessly that is to open up. And then check out this, folks. When have you seen a grain truck built so beautiful inside? Look at those nice heavy duty tarp bows up there, folks. They're built like a truss on a barn roof. They not only hold up the tarp, they also hold the box together. Again, all beautiful shiny aluminum construction inside to outside, top to bottom. It's all that way. Now look at that. We have a nice solid weather seal that goes all the way around the back of this truck. Folks, let's go ahead and open up this other cargo door. Look at the weather stripping, folks. It's sealed, it's waterproof, top to bottom, and it's smooth here. When you dump it out, the grain is coming off, period. Hanging up on absolutely nothing. Now, folks, we'll let John get this all closed back up, and we're gonna continue on up the passenger, excuse me, the driver's side of this grain body. Now, folks, as we move along here, take a look. We have the absolute uh, paint guards up there to prevent the aluminum sides from getting scratched with the tarp. It's got the return bungee cord system on it. Folks, it's all here inclusive in one nice thought-through package. Folks, if you have any other features you'd like to see added to it, don't hesitate for a moment. Folks, we're here to do this custom for you. Right here, though, is a truck that'll get the job done today now it's for sale now folks these chassis are virtually impossible to find in this kind of a factory spec condition folks just take a look at the beautiful paint on this side of the cab as we move forward you can see for yourself it's absolutely gorgeous folks with that I'm going to give you a nice quick look at the inside of the cab we're going to come up close and show you we have the controls located very easy to access. You can stand right here and operate the hoist, or you can absolutely go and operate the hoist from the back of the truck. Folks, I'm telling you, it's a very, very nice truck. With that, folks, I'm going to come up here and give you a look at the door panel. Take a look at the beautiful door panel as we come up here and look along the bottom of the doors. Absolutely no rust on the bottom of the doors or the cab cowling. Folks, with that, I'm going to let John talk to you about the interior a moment, and then we'll get on with the video. Here you go, John. Yes, folks, look at the interior of this, of this uh, truck here. Uh, if you're looking for a good grain truck, you don't have to look any further. You got the PTO controls right here, your hydraulics right here. You can stand here while you're unloading and operate your controls. Get up inside here and look at, at the cleanliness of this unit. It's been well taken care of, well maintained, and it's ready to go to work for you, folks. There's no rust around the doors. Like Jake said, this is the original paint, and it's all ready to go to work for you right now. Okay, folks, with that, John's going to fire up this girl and raise this body up so you can see that portion working as well. Now, while he does that, let's come up here and take a look at the dash. You can see all the gauges doing their job. You see the needles sweeping and resetting like they're supposed to. And look at that. Tack comes right up. Look at the evidence, the fuel gauge working, voltmeter, air pressure, both gauges. And look at that oil pressure, 50 pounds at 1,000 RPMs. Where are you going to beat that, folks? With that, John's going to engage the PTO, and here we go. Now, look how nice and smooth that body goes up, folks. You can run this bed up or down from the front or the back, and in a moment, we'll show you the rear control. Folks, it's a beautiful truck in every way. We've tried to think through it to make it as user-friendly as possible. Folks, with that, we're going to shut the engine off so we can hear better in the video and show you everything underneath there on this truck. 
Let's take a look here as we come up close. We're going to show you the rear bed controls first. We can absolutely operate that from the front or the back. In a minute, we'll have John show you how he can lower it from the back as well. Take a look at these nice, meaty gripper drive tires, folks. Take a look, matching all the way around. Heavy duty Hendrickson suspension, full double frame with no rust on the frame. And folks, look at that heavy, massive hoist. Full twin cylinder Omaha scissor hoist. Folks, it's hard to express exactly what you're looking at, folks. This is a nice, nice grain truck with all the features you could possibly want. And again, if we're missing something you want, don't be afraid to ask. Just give us a call. Folks, look at this long seal. Look at the nice construction on here. All aluminum C-channel cross members, floors, and long seals. Folks, again, beautiful, beautiful truck. It's got the reinforcements by the hinge plates and up here at the lift points on the scissors. Folks, it's all here again, designed for longevity and strength. John, come to the back and show them how you can lower the bed from the rear of the truck as well as from the front. Now, John's going to show you there's a rear hoist control mounted here so you can comfortably stand right here and raise and lower the body from the back. Now, pushing forward for down and pushing back for up. Just look how nice and slick that comes out. Now, folks, imagine unloading grain and you're at the back of the truck. You're able to operate standing right there at the back, looking back right where you're possible yes shoot is folks you can't beat that operation of a rear control folks again integrated into a nice slick unit just for you folks with that as soon as the bed gets down we're going to go ahead and jump in this truck and we're now going to take you for a road test so come along john's going to get in the driver's side we'll join him in the passenger side and here we go we're going to not only tell you how nice this truck runs and drives we're going to show you so come along and enjoy the test drive now as we get in the passenger side folks take a look beautiful door panel on this side as well no rust look at the nice super clean floor mats beautiful upholstery on the seats all factory original stuff come on in now and join john here in the cab now folks we're going to take a moment and we're going to talk about this transmission folks what we have here is a very unique special transmission folks it's easy to shift and operate it's a regular eight speed with a low hole and folks you can downshift this thing to a granny gear and we have it in absolute granny gear and john's got to rev the sucker up just to get it out of its tracks now look at this now john let off the throttle let's let him show how slow it actually goes now look at this at an idle in the low hole I'm positive a Snell can go as fast as this, folks. That is how slow this is. Now, show them how the low, low reverse is as well, folks. Take a look at this. Now, in reverse, now just go ahead and gauge yourself with that trailer tire over there. We are in reverse with the clutch fully out at an idle. And I'm telling you, I think a Snell can back up this fast, too. Folks, with that, let's go ahead, and we're going to shift her back into road range, and we're going to head out here and show you that all the gears work and perform properly. Now, John can flawlessly power shift this truck. So for you guys that think you got to have an automatic, hey, I'm not here to talk you out of it, but I'm telling you, you don't need to use the clutch just because it's a manual transmission. These suckers can be power shifted. All you need the clutch for is to put it in first gear. After that, you just flawlessly power shift through it. And I tell you what, the power and the ratios and everything you have with a manual transmission, you have way more power and torque than you're ever going to dream of having with an automatic because of all the extra gears. Look at that, just shifts right through it. Power to who tight them. I'm telling you folks, this is an amazing piece. Gets right out here and runs. It's a nice quiet cab, we can hear real well. Now look at that, John does not have his foot on the clutch. I'm gonna show you there when he shifts the next gear. Now look at that, one gear to the next, no feet on the clutch. Folks, I'm telling you, it's all here and it's exciting. This sucker drives like a new truck with power that you can't imagine. John, tell them how she runs, in your opinion. This is a nice running truck. Look, I'm just gonna take my hands off the wheel. It goes straight down the road. It just holds as straight as the string. The, the gears are tight. The transmission is tight. It's quiet. It's just a nice unit. When you start adding up everything in this truck that you want in a grain truck, the heavy duty axles, the aluminum bed, the, uh, the motor that looks like it's been recently overhauled, just everything this truck will last you a lifetime 
Folks, don't wait. Call today. These, these trucks are selling fast. Folks, with that, we're going to go ahead and proceed to wrap up this video. I'm telling you, folks, I know we sound extremely excited in this video, and the reason is we are excited. It's an exciting piece. You can't duplicate this overnight, possibly not even next year. It's that way. It's that kind of a truck. It's one of a kind. Truly, folks, it's here. 40,000 rears, 13,000 front, all factory. I'm telling you, just you might want to just simply hit the stop button on your video right now and call before this sells under out of you. Folks, give us a call, 260-238-5000, or visit us on our website at www.99, the two number nines, and the word trucks, T-R-U-C-K-S dot com. Folks, with that, we're going to thank you again for your time and shopping with Integrity Sales and Services, and remember, John and I are standing by to take your call now.